Hello everyone, this is Pastor Sean from Christians Unite, and this is a video series called Topics. On this edition of Topics, we're going to be looking at New Year's resolutions and why yours should be spending more time with Jesus this year. So this New Year's, I want to challenge everyone, including myself, to read your Bibles, spend daily time with God, uh, get a little closer to him this year by taking those moments to actually hear what he has to say. This is, in very, this is very important because during these times, we see all the troubles and tribulations, and there's a lot to worry about and a lot to be concerned with, with how our society is going. I'm going to read you a verse to um, show you that God is in our corner and uh, that we do not need to worry if we have a Savior, uh, if we just surrender ourselves and um, spend time with him. We're going to look at Luke uh, chapter 22, and we're going to read up to verse 34. Then Jesus said to his disciples, Therefore I tell you, do not worry about your life, what you will eat or what your body will wear. For life is more than food and the body more than clothes. Consider the ravens. They do not sow or reap. They have no storeroom or barn, yet God feeds them. And how much more valuable are you than the birds? Who of you by worrying can add a single hour to your life? Since you cannot do this very little thing, why do you worry about the rest? Consider how the wild flowers grow. They do not labor or spin. Yet I tell you, not even Solomon in all his splendor was dressed like one of those. If that is how God clothes the grass of the field, which is here today and tomorrow is thrown into the fire, how much more will he clothe you? you with little faith. And do not set your heart on which you will eat or drink. Do not worry about it. For the pagans' wor world runs after such things, and your father knows that you need them. But seek his kingdom, and these things will be given to you as well. Do not be afraid, little flock, for your father has been pleased to give you the kingdom. Sell your possessions and give to the poor. Provide... Provide purse, purses for yourselves that you will not wear out a treasure in heaven. That will never fail. Where no thief comes near and no moth destroys. For where your treasure is, your heart will be also. So those verses show that we need to be focused on the kingdom of heaven. So, yes, we need clothes, we need food but God will provide. So we should trust in his promises, focus on our relationship with him, and he will do the rest. This requires faith. And for me, that's challenging as well. But this year, we need to do that. We need to have faith in God like never before, because we do not know the time or the hour when he will return. And we should live our lives as close to Jesus as possible. Jesus gave an example to us all what we should be doing. There was times where Jesus separated himself and found a place that he could be alone so he could pray and he could talk to God. We should be doing the same thing. If Jesus did this on earth, we should be doing that as well. So let's make a commitment this year, spend more time with God, even if it's just 15 minutes a day reading a Bible verse or just praying, um, praying somewhere that you can connect with God. Just 15 minutes a day and that's it. If you can do more, do more. So let's make this commitment and make that our resolution. God bless.